Holy shit here today. We're going to talk about Dao Chan. Uh, but first, I've taken a little break. Uh, having a hard time playing the game lately. Just not a whole lot of interest. Uh, but I was just uh, doing a raid today and I saw this new hero. I'm like, hmm, let me see what uh, she's about. Uh, so, kind of interesting. I, I need the new factor. So, there's not enough new stuff going on. Uh, especially uh, when I was kind of a pay-to-play player, but now I'm a free-to-play. Uh, and on, I'm actually going to make a video about uh, why I made that change. I'm sure some other people have different reasons. It has nothing, nothing to do with uh, empires and, and puzzles or small giant, rather. Um, but it's more or less a uh, personal change uh, or even a resolution uh, to not spend my money here and use my money uh, to invest uh, a little bit wiser. But anyway, I'm digressing. So let's talk about some of the stats. Dao Chan, 5-star, Sorcerer, Kingdom Family, 825 power, uh, attack stats 797, defense 788, hit points 1437, extremely respectable without emblems. Uh, so... Let's see, what does she do here? Because I'm seeing her for the first time. Uh, she summons, uh, she, she's a healer. Uh, she heals for 35% and summons a lackey minion for the caster and the two uh, near heroes. Uh, but this is why I thought it was kind of cool is uh, that those minions steal the buffs that uh, you have in, on your uh, team or your, your opponent's team. And uh, depending on how many minions, uh, you have a chance to snag one of those buffs. So I just wanted to see that in action. Now this uh, Dao Chan here is not even list, you know, upgraded at all. So uh, really trying to just keep her alive and have her just pop off her ability so I could see what, what she does and uh, see how she grabs uh, your buffs. Um, looks like she's got some other bonuses. I don't really care. Like, you know, she has, depending on it, if you're in a, uh, if you have three of the same um, war family, you get one, two, or three heroes, you can get buffs of uh, two to four to six percent mana, two to three to four percent heal, which is, uh, in my opinion, not a game changer, not worth chasing that. Um, let's see. Morale boost, what is that? Uh, morale boost uh, belonging to the same kingdom family. Uh, so basically, if, if you have you know one of these family members, uh, when you hit the War of Kingdoms, which is kind of a new thing, you have a uh, boost of 10% uh, attack, 3% defense, 7% health boost. Kind of cool. Uh, but anyway, so yeah. Totally uh, missing the, the video here, but... Um, yeah, you can see that each time that minion hits uh, one of my heroes, it, it'll kind of randomly snag something. So uh, that one it just uh, snagged some some attack. It's, uh, she's got some defense. Um, but one thing I noticed is, um, you know, you could have like two minions, uh, you know, on, on defense, and it's really only snagging something random. So you can't... You know, you keep snagging the same duplicate, like, buff. Um, and I really don't know if it, that buff just lasts for the, like, for several turns. Um, or is it until the minion is gone. Um, but I'm not going to re-attack re this uh, hero and figure out too much. I just wanted to see how cool it was to snag the buffs and how many can stack on there. Uh, the most I could get get on there was four. That's why I have this set up here. Is I got like attack, uh, mana boost, um, attack. Uh, what else I got here? Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. So kind of a neat hero. Um, game changer, probably not. Um, fun to use, absolutely. Um, Opinion of grade, that's uh, pretty much impossible to tell because this hero is not upped at all, but uh, definitely, I would say, a uh, top tier uh, healer. Uh, kind of built for more of a flank position, but I have a feeling that in this wing position, uh, she could be extremely annoying 
to get rid of if, you, if you're not using like snipers and whatnot because you could just keep stealing your buffs heal as you as you heal um, yeah anyway yeah so that's that um, but yeah look for uh, you know my next video because I'm gonna talk about uh, why I switched from uh, pay to play to uh, free to play and I think there's gonna be some interesting stuff that could be life-changing for you so if you like today's content subscribe hit like leave a comment i catch you on the next time all right later